previously on Pokemon Go. Alrighty, what is going on guys? It's Lachlan here and welcome back to another exciting episode of Pokemon Go. So for today's episode, I've actually got something awesome planned. I'm going to be heading into Brisbane City. It's like a 20 minute drive. Honestly, I don't know what to really expect from the city. I've heard lots of good things about being in like metropolitan areas for Pokemon Go. So it should be pretty exciting. Hope we'll find a lot of new Pokemon and maybe some rares if we could. That'd be great too. And just catching up on where we left off in the last episode and what I did off screen. So if I go ahead and sort them through number right here, you can see that I've actually caught myself my own little Bulbasaur. Um, he was just outside my house, so I was like, yep, that's happening. I couldn't really record at the time. And uh, then apart from that, I think that is all for new Pokemon. I think there was one other one. Oh, I caught another Eevee as well, so we're really close. Oh, and here's the big thing as well. Ready? Look at this. Yeah, we have 22 Eevee candies, and with three more, we can go ahead and evolve. Now, apparently this is like completely random. You're going to get one of three every time, so I'm really excited. Hopefully we can accomplish ourselves a Jolteon today. That would be pretty sick. And yeah, I pretty much just sorted through the rest of my Pokemon, got rid of all the duplicates, got rid of all the Zubats, all the Doduos. I'm, I think I have enough Doduo candy to evolve another one. No, I don't. I don't really care either way. In other news as well, we need two more Rattata candies to evolve a Rattata into a Raticate, so hopefully we can accomplish that again today as well. And then, and then we're only another 27 Pidgey candies off getting Pidgeot. So unfortunately there's no evolutions to start off with for today's episode, but I also want to check in on our eggs and we need to run or walk or drive uh, 800 meters to get this last egg and then another 2Ks for the other one. So hopefully both those will get done and uh, we've got so many other eggs here. Oh, we got more of these. Okay, let's put them all in. Might as well. Alrighty, so it's off to go pick up Billy who was our cameraman yesterday and stacked it horrendously on the jump. That was actually pretty hilarious. Uh, but yeah, no, we're going to pick him up. He's going to be our cameraman for today. You know, it's funny. I've got three cameramen. I've got Taylor, who did the one on the beach. i got Jay, who did the course the first two. And then Billy, who does like the weekends. They're like, I'm just using my friends for camera people. It, it's good fun. The man, Billy himself, here to catch us some legendaries today. Isn't that right, Billy? We're ready to actually get real Pokemon. Yeah, none of that. None of that yesterday stuff. None of that constant Zubat every single time. That was that was disgusting Too many yesterday. around here. Yeah, no. Now we just got to pray the servers don't crash. All right, we're just about to leave. I'm taking the SIM card out to place it in my Nexus, and I've dropped it down the side of the seat. And... I don't know where it is. No worry, Billy is a legendary. Somehow got it out. It's like literally right under the seat. All right, now the adventure hopefully begins. All right, so we just spent like pretty much 30 minutes trying to set up that camera so it doesn't fall off. Watch for it for when it falls off. So on the way to the city, I'm gonna chuck on a bunch of incenses. Uh, see if we can find stuff on the way there. It's always good fun. Chuck the lucky egg down. Chuck the uh, incense down, and maybe we might travel slow enough. But sometimes there might be traffic. Imagine if there's traffic. Oh, and there's a do do it to get things started. Wouldn't have it any other way. Oh, that, and that's the camera setup we're rocking with right now. That, that, that's that's the ghetto setup. Like, look at it. Don't do it. What do you think? It's pretty bad, isn't it? This is meta. It's like within the vlogs. It's it's so crazy. Now was a really good toss. How cool is that? I gotta make sure I don't block you guys. Oh, and it did it. <laughs> All right. Oh, we got another one. Oh, Nidoran. I want that. So yeah, trying to catch up and stock up on Nidoran as much as I can. I'm just gonna go AR mode now. Um, just to try and get, you know, a Nido King eventually. That's the goal, right? And this guy, let's go for a little bit of a trick shot, trick shot, curve coming in, you ready? All right, that's way off. <laughs> All right, wait, and, da! Ah! Oh, that's a good curve, that's a curveball right there. Because I think every time I've used a curveball, yeah, curveball seems to make it easy to catch, and you get bonus points for it, if I'm not mistaken. No, that was a nice throw, okay. Whatever. Clefairy! Okay, now I've already caught one of these, so that's whatever, but you know, I'm here to get the evolutions, so... Whoa, this is a high-level Clefairy. That's like the like highest level one I've seen. Right, I'm gonna go another curveball. Let's test our theory. Ah, uh, it's just so hard. No, I'm wasting so many Pokeballs. Oh, there we go. That's a curve. That's a curve. Let's see if the curve works. There wasn't a big curve. I think the bigger the curve, the more effective it is. There's not, nah, not happening. All right. Bang is, there we go. Clefairy down. One step closer to a Clefable. 50 candies needed though. Not good, not good. Now 
Ooh. All right, so we just got into the city and things are popping off. On the other side of the city, on South Bank, you can see all the lures just going off. So we're probably going to hit up that side or maybe let's see what's on this side of the city as well. Oh, dude, yeah, this side of the city is... Oh, like every like second or third pokey stop has a lure down. So we're going to go check them out. See what the hype's about, maybe see some other people there as well. Um, on the way though, we saw a bunch of Pokemon, but we realized that uh, trying to catch Pokemon on the highway doesn't work because if you miss the first Pokeball, they run away straight away. It like notices the difference. And there's a Rattata underneath me. I think we're actually at the spot where we can actually catch Pokemon and we can also hit up all these Poke Stops on the way. So this is gonna be exciting. I love how I'm greeted into the city by a rat. That's lovely. See, I don't want to actually catch bad Pokemon here. Like, I want to try and find new ones as soon as I see them. Um, let's see what we got here. Oh, and a new medal for 50 normal types. Pretty lit. Uh, directly underneath two Pokestops. Leaves and something monules or whatever. I wasted so many Pokeballs on the highway missing all those Pokemon. There's a post office there. Easy work. Nice work. All right, so we actually take a left here. There's two lures right on the other side. And there's a gym there. That gym's probably hectic. There was a slow poke on the way in as well, but we weren't able to get him. Oh, there's a magic cup. There's a magic cup. Oh, boy, there's a magic cup. So, to, in order to get yourself a Gyarados, you have to catch over 100 magic cups. So, you get three for each one you catch, and then if you transfer, which manually would take ages. Um, so, yeah, we'll catch you guys on foot. I just got myself a magic cup. See you guys in a bit. Is it sad that if I moved out of my house, I would literally look to see if there's a Pokestop nearby? Like, I genuinely think that a real estate agent could try to sell me on the fact that it's got four Pokestops that normally, for 50% of the time, have a lure down. I'd be like, hit me up, fam. Let's go. All right, boys, we just got to Eagle Street Pier. There's a lure down. There's an Eevee, a magic cup, and a Weedle. So this is absolutely lit. Let's catch this we uh, Eevee, and then we're solid for an evolution. All right, so I just caught that Eevee we were talking about, and uh, it's time to go down. We're now going to evolve Eevee. We want Jolteon, Flareon. Actually, Flareon's the worst, and then Vaporeon will be like, you know, whatever. But Jolteon or Bust, pretty much, for the most part. Here we go. 25 Eevee candies. Evolve. Come on, Jolteon. Please. Please. He's got some sparks going on. Please, Jolteon. Please. Come on. Come on. Oh. <laughs> we got the false prophet. The false prophet Flareon. Feels bad, man. Feels bad, man. To be fair, the Flareon's level 558. So that's going to be pretty sick to put in a gym. Him, that 568 pincer. We're building a team. This is happening. found a slow poke in the water. Uh, this is a new Pokemon for us, so this is pretty huge if we catch it. Great throw. Goodbye. And there's the... Oh, I can't really move it over because I caught it too quickly. And there we go. We did have a Jigglypuff and then it disappeared. And now there's a Magikarp and we're battling it. Alrighty, so I have absolutely no idea why, but I'm just here on my eggs page. Five out of five Ks and it hasn't hatched. Oh no, 4.98. Okay, fair enough. They've rounded up. And then uh, we've got another one at 1.2 Ks but should be pretty good. It's been a pretty decent trip thus far. Billy, there's a venom out on you. Don't worry, I got it. Good. All right, scratch the egg hype. Oh, no way. Out of nowhere. All right, here we go. Come on, what are we gonna get? Please, please. I want Dragonite, Dratini, new two, something good. <laughs> Walked five Ks for a polywag. This is freaking mental. Look how many lures are going off. It's crash. It's like it's glitching my screen. There's too much to load. And actually, it's just so many particles. For days, lure modules everywhere. It's gonna be fun. So pretty much everybody's on their phones here. I wonder what they're doing. Uh, but I'm out here I'm catching a Volpix. New Pokemon. If I catch that. You can see everybody just flicking their screen. Uh, flicking their screen. Want, he's not playing paper tops. I'll tell you that much. All right, there we go. Volpix secured. New Pokemon hype. City is, you know, bringing the goods today. That's for sure. Okay, so I found a gold bat. Don't really care about the gold bat, but gym right here, level 700 Pidgeot. Let's do it. I'm down. I'm down. I'm game. Uh, so it's gonna be one v one, Flareon versus Pidgeot. Let's see how this goes. I'm down. Let's see how this. Uh, what can I? I can change him out. 
probably better to go with Flareon in this situation. So yeah, we're gonna go Flareon, let's do it. Here we go, one versus one. Let's do it, buddy. Let's do it. Once again, apologies for the noise, but I can't really do much about that. Here we go, let's get the party started. All right, it's been shot, that's Flareon. We're not able to take it down. It's too high a level, dude. Level 700. Oh, yeah. All right, I'm recording the egg. It, it's, I couldn't get the screen capture to go on time. I don't know what we're going to get. Another repeat. Lit. Great. Star you. Awesome. <laughs> Alrighty guys, and we are out of the city. So we're here for about, I don't know if it was like half hour, hour? Yeah. yeah. So I went through Eagle Street Pier, went through um, Queen Street Mall, just going off, popping with lures and pokey loots and whatnot. Poke stops, I should say. Yeah, today's been a pretty successful trip. As you guys can see here, these are all the Pokemon we've caught today on our trip. So Staryu being the egg that popped last. And then all the way down to... That star you there, I think, is where we started. Um, so that's pretty good. That's all these Pokemon we've caught today. Um, a few new ones being the Vulpix. Uh, Pidgeot is not exactly new because we did a Volume yesterday. And the Slowpoke. Uh, then a bunch of others which we might be able to work up to evolve. And then, of course, Flareon as well. So, and the other thing as well, we got level 12, which gave us the unlock for, wait for it, Great balls, and we already got a couple from the poker loots or poker stops and whatnot, so that's really exciting. And uh, definitely on our way to be catching some more Pokemon. So, if you guys did enjoy today's episode of Pokemon Go, if you did, let me know with the like rating down below. And uh, we'll catch you hopefully tomorrow with another exciting edition of Pokemon Go. See you guys then.